But right now we have this new for you at 530 Piedmont Lithium holding an open house at its new Belmont headquarters today. And you'll recall this is the company that hopes to use Gaston County Mine to produce electric vehicle batteries. U.S. Senator Tom Tillis, as you just saw in that video there for today's event, showing his support for the company. WCNC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson joins us live from Belmont with more on this open house. So what did Senator Tillis have to say? Well, first off, there were about a dozen people, over a dozen people in attendance, and the U.S. Senator says that Gaston County should be the next place for lithium, but it should be done responsibly. He said he's also excited for the potential jobs it could bring. Fuel of the future, lithium considered the new oil. We're sitting on top of the largest single deposit of high-grade lithium in North America. We have to lead by example. And if we do that, we'll accelerate our self-dependence. Piedmont Lithium held an opening for their new headquarters in Belmont Wednesday afternoon. The move represents an important next step in the company's plans to invest in the region. That project will employ over 400 people directly. Uh, it will probably, we believe, employ over or bring over 1,000 jobs in total to the area. And we think be a big economic boom to the county. The company hopes the lithium they extract will power electric vehicles and cell phones. The company still waits for state regulators to review its proposal for a flagship operation in Gaston County. Still, some local businesses are skeptical. Is it right for our community? Um, you know, it's very tight knit around here. Many residents fear the mine will contaminate their water supply, pollute surrounding land, and damage their home's value. James Gabehart, manager of Nellie's Southern Kitchen, says he thinks it's important for Piedmont Lithium to have open conversations with residents in the area. The outreach to everyone, the businesses, let them know what you're going to be doing here, what we can expect from you. Um, definitely don't leave people hanging. And Senator Tillis says he does want to address people's concerns, but he really thinks that this project will put Gaston County on the map. Now, as for Piedmont Lithium, they hope to have the permitting process approved by 2023. Reporting live in Belmont for WCNC Charlotte, I'm Lexi Wilson. Lexi, thank you.